All right. Hello there. You're with Bruce and Belinda in Century 21 Integrity Group. We're here with Father Tom. He invited us to bring our 3D camera into St. John's Church and School. And so we're happy to have Father Tom with us to give us a little bit of a tour. Thank you, Belinda. Bruce, thank you very much. I uh, welcome you all here to St. Francis of Assisi Parish and St. John the Baptist Catholic Church. We're going to take a little tour and to show you uh, what we have as a home for our family of faith here in the city of Jefferson. And uh, we hope you enjoy this little tour. We're heading up our front stairs now through the big doors and into our church. We come into the into the lobby of the church of the bell tower. Here you see a statue you see on the tour later on. That's St. Nathburga. She comes with the church and she is the patroness of farm wives from, uh, from Bohemia and Bavaria and brought here uh, when the settlers came to form their churches in Jefferson from Germany, uh, St. Nathburga came as a patroness of the farmers who settled here. She welcomes you also. Now we enter our church. We enter at the baptismal font, which is here put together by Father Monsignor Terry Connors in 1997. The baptismal font was modernized and made prominent in the entrance of the church to remind us that we belong to the family of God by virtue of our baptism in the Lord Jesus. And you can see here, it is a beautiful, expansive church built in the 1860s and expanded in 1900 with an additional sanctuary and uh, remodeled two or three times. In 1959, the uh, sanctuary was simplified and in 1997, the sanctuary was modified once again. But the body of the church, as you can see, it remains as it was in the 1860s and then when a little additional money came into the congregation, the beautiful stained glass windows in the church, as we walk by them, you can, you can uh, go on the website and take a look at each of the windows if you wish. They're gorgeous and they are an important part of the atmosphere of our family of faith and our Church of God. The sanctuary is about 85 feet from the front door of the church. The bell tower is probably 160 feet high. It's a beautiful uh, testimony to the dedication of the ancestors of our parish, those who founded this church. The cornerstone says 1866. And um, you'll see that it was built a uh, church and school, Kirka Church und Gymnasium School. That was the ancestors' um, legacy when they came from the home country, from Bavaria and Bohemia, and that was exactly what they wished to have for their new community and their families. Before they built themselves, um, much more than a shack sufficient to keep the elements off of them, they came together and built this beautiful church. And if you're in Jefferson, you'll notice on the next church over also St. John's Lutheran. This is St. John's, St. John the Baptist Catholic Church. Next to us, St. John the Evangelist Lutheran Church, also built probably by the same workers in the 1860s, dedicated to their profound respect for their Lord and they wanted their God to have the best house in town. And they certainly did that. <laughs> and uh, it is still uh, magnificent, their dedication to their faith and their dedication to the welfare of their family in faith and in education. You can see the sanctuary, the uh, beautiful 
blue light that comes in was on Senior Connor's edition in 1997 to, to make the, the church. Uh, I invite you to take a look at the website in as much detail as you would. There are many, many wonderful uh, mysteries of the church revealed there. People giving uh, very good information from the formation of the uh, parish and the formation of this holy site. So enjoy the website. Know you're welcome in this holy place anytime. And uh, thank you very much.